Doesn't it feel weird that every time a video starts, we just sit here and do nothing? You know what? Yeah, that makes sense. I wonder why. Just, just, just continue the video. Well, we might as well just watch TV then, Freddy. Yeah, it's probably best for now. Let's see what's on TV. Hi there, I'm Willy Weasel. Welcome to my Wonderland. Having the most boring birthday of your life? Well, come on down to my Wonderland. We have arcades, games, and the... Uh, the uh, the super happy fun room. Yeah, yeah. How did I forget about that? And most of all, on your birthday, we get to sing the happy birthday song. It's your birthday, and we want you to. So what are you waiting for? Come on down to Willie's Wonderland and have the best birthday of your life. Huh? Would you look at that? Looks like Willie finally decided to open up a restaurant. I remember back in high school, he always wanted to do that, but then he never got the chance to do it. And now look at him. He looks like he's doing a really good job at opening the restaurant. Uh, hey, Mom and Dad, how you guys doing? Oh, hey, son, we're just watching TV. Um, how's the wedding plan going? It's going on great. We actually have a schedule for next month. My Frederick is funny little grown-up, and he's getting married. Mom, please, not in front of my wife. Oh, right, sorry. But yeah, so I'm actually pretty excited to finally get married. I mean, I just hope that it all goes according to plan and that Clara Freddy doesn't really mess it up. Why would he mess it up? N never mind. Uh, let's just watch TV, yeah. Just watch TV. Okay, then. Who's out at the door? Oh, I don't know. I wasn't expecting anything today. Frederick, what if it's Glamrock Freddy again? Just stay right here, okay? I'll go check. Uh, hello? Hi there. I'm Willy Weasel. Um, is Freddy Fazbear here? Oh, you're, you're looking for my dad. Yeah, he's inside. Huh, didn't know he was married. Well, okay, cool. Who is this guy? <sighs> so who was at the door? It was this guy. Not too sure who he is, but he's there. Wait, what? Hi there, Freddy. Willie, what are you doing here? Oh, nothing much. Just came here to visit one of my old high school buddies. Wait a second, you two know each other? Yeah, we were old high school buddies. We met a long, long time ago. Right, really? Yeah, we known each other for years. And I known Chica for a while, too. Well, it's great seeing you again, Willie. How come you guys never told me you two got married? Well, didn't I send you an invite to the wedding or something, dude? Because I sent you plenty of emails. Huh, I might have been sleeping on that day. Well, anyway, you never told me you had a son, too. Actually, a son and a daughter. But she isn't here right now. She's with her boyfriend. Man, I am way far behind, aren't I? Huh, you guys know each other for a while now, actually. So, that means you must be Freddy's son. Uh, are you gonna introduce yourself? Uh, yeah, um, my name is Frederick, and this is my fiance, Frianna. Wow, congratulations. When's the wedding? Next month. Oh, sweet. I'll, I'll make sure I'll be there this time. I won't over oversleep like I did last time. So anyway, really, what are you doing here? Aren't you supposed to be at your restaurant, you know, working and all that stuff with the crew? Or wait, do you have a crew? Yeah, I do have a crew. Uh, they're pretty stressful to deal with, especially Tito. He speaks a lot of Spanish and it's hard to understand it. And it's getting pretty annoying, actually. Then there's Gus, who's always hungry. He nearly bit my ear off, but... I was able to get away, and Ozzy bit them back, and they started fighting again, and then Nighty Night had to get into the situation. He almost killed Gus, I think. Uh, it was pretty bad. Wow, that, that that's pretty deep. Okay, a little weird. But that's not even the worst part, Freddy. I've gone bankrupt. Wait, what? you gone bankrupt? What do you mean you went bankrupt? I thought your restaurant is very popular. Well, yeah, since 1984, the restaurant is very popular, the franchise got bigger, but then the whole incident thing with the murderer guys and the and the, and the, and the super happy fun room thing, it, it went crazy, and the public started avoiding my restaurant, and I started losing money. Wait, back up, did you say murderers? Yeah, there was this guy named Jerry Robert Willis, I hired him to be one of the janitors, and... Apparently, he went inside one of the costumes in the Super Happy Fun Room, and I don't want to go in too into it, but it was pretty bad. Well, did they catch the guy? Oh, yeah, right, yeah, they, they did. They caught him. But, like, still, the public avoided my restaurant, and I, I lost a lot of money. I couldn't pay the bills. My crew started to go hungry, and we... We, we've been struggling a lot recently, especially with the coronavirus thing. Yeah, that that's what made it worse. Well, is there anything I could do? Well, there must be something we can do. We can give you a check and help you pay the bills. I mean, we have a lot of money, so we can help you, you know, Willie. 
Or we could set up a donation thing for Willy's Wonderland. I mean, that'd be pretty neat, too. Actually, that might not cut it. I need Freddy to shut down this restaurant. But, but Willy, I love my restaurant. I love it so much. Listen, Freddy, I, I might be wrong or I might be right, but I think your restaurant is what causing my public to get away from my restaurant. Look at your restaurant, Freddy. It's gotten so much popular. You get a lot of money and they're avoiding my restaurant and it's hurting me. So I think it'd probably be best if you shut it down. Willie, there has to be something else I can do. I, I'm not going to shut down my restaurant. I, I love it. I I use it to provide stuff for my family. I... I don't know, Willie. I, there must be something else I can do. Look, Freddy. I know this restaurant means a lot to you, but... If... If I don't do something about this for my crew... Then we're all gonna go homeless. We're not gonna have any food. We're gonna starve, Freddy. So, I'm not asking you anymore. Please shut down your restaurant so you can help me. Look, Willie. I don't know what's going on here, but I know that your restaurant's going bankrupt and you're going through a lot right now and I get it. But look, you can't just force my dad to shut down our restaurant. But we can do something else to help you. Just tell us what to do and we will do it. Look, kid, I don't want anyone getting hurt. So please step out of my way and let me handle this situation. Sorry, Willie. I can't let you do this. I'm not gonna ask anymore. <sighs> I think it's probably best that you leave. When you calm down, you can come back and we can help you in any other way possible. But we're not shutting down our restaurant. So goodbye, Willie. What, Freddy. Uh, I'm sorry, Willie. But you have to go. Just, just go, please. Fine. Freddy, what's going on? I just don't get it. Why does everyone I know have to do something bad? Doesn't make any sense. Willie's not that kind of a guy. Willie's really nice. He's heartwarming. He's really kind to his friends. Let's just hope that all works out. What am I going to tell my friends? Having some trouble there, buddy? Who said that? Ah, oh, don't worry. I'm just an old friend of Freddy. <laughs> and don't worry. I can help you gain back your popularity on your restaurant. That is if you join me. No, I I don't want to do anything bad. I, I just I just want my restaurant to gain its popularity again. That's all I want. Look, I'm not going to join you. But I will help you take down like the restaurant. But I don't want anyone getting hurt. Please, no one gets hurt. I just want my restaurant back. Well then, looks like you got yourself a deal. Just promise me that no one gets hurt. I cross my heart and hope to die. <laughs>